Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Wii System Menu version 1.0 on Dolphin. So you've probably seen these videos on YouTube where they um, show the Wii System Menu 1.0 um, running on Dolphin and not many people know how to install it on Dolphin. So I will be showing you how to install it. Um, installing it on a real NAND is not recommended because anything could happen uh, I haven't really suffered the consequences before um, but it's your decision and I haven't really researched <coughs> uh, any of that so it's basically at your own risk um, and I am not responsible for any damage to it but if you want is if you install on dolphin it should be fine so before we start you should have a copy of dolphin of course and you're going to need a wad um a wad file of the wii system menu 1.0 uh it really doesn't matter which region i mean i i just did you and yeah i just did you <laughs> which is usa so I actually have a keep clicking on the wrong directory okay uh, I already have it right here we menu 1.0 u so that's basically all we need um, besides dolphin so we just need the wide and dolphin so you're gonna go ahead and open up dolphin and once you open it um, you may see the Wii menu um, right here or it might be something else like Wii system menu or system menu or something but it'll say something like Wii menu um, now if you do not see it you're going to have to put the file in a directory of what you set your games to so if you set it to Wii games if that's your folder and your WAD file is in the download, you're going to have to transfer the uh, file from the download over to, let's say, the doc it was the Wii Games folder was in the document. So you go to Documents, then Wii Games, and then drop it in there. And then restart Dolphin, and then you should see it display here. Sometimes you may need to uh, re uh, restart Dolphin. Sometimes you don't have to, but sometimes you have to. So once you found it on the title list, uh, you're going to go ahead and left click it once, and then you're gonna go ahead and right click it. And you should see um, these options here. So you should see properties, wiki, install to NAND, you know, stuff like that. So under wiki, uh, there should be install to the NAND or uninstall from the NAND. So you're basically going to install it to the NAND so if you already have a copy installed like 4.3 for an example it will overwrite this um, and you're going to have to uh, install all the WAD files if you did install any back on to the NAND so that's a little warning um, so you're gonna go on to install to the NAND and you should come up with a message saying successfully installed this title to the NAND. Now, there you go. So, that's basically it. Um, I can't really show you because uh, uh, my PC is very bad at running different processes. And especially screen recording software and Dolphin at the same time. Dolphin uses a lot of resources, um, especially running at 60 FPS. Um, so I can't really show you, but all you need to do now is go up to tools and you should see this um, option here. It'll, it'll, it should say uh, load Wii system menu 1.0 U or, or whatever version you installed. It didn't have to be 1.0, but most likely whoever wanted to install 1.0 it would be 1.0 so uh, if you do not see this and if you see something else 
like load Wii system and you 4.3 let's say you had that installed previously and you should like you still see that after you installed 1.0 um, you're just gonna go ahead and close out of dolphin and then um, open open it back up so basically just restart it and then you, when you go back up to tools it should say 1.0 or whatever version you installed so that's basically it um, and then you can go ahead and delete this um, after installing it you don't have to but I mean if you don't want to have this in your Wii games list yeah uh, obviously so that's pretty much it um, it's rarely simple to do uh, it's really not that hard all you need is the file dolphin you install it on dolphin and you can run it and um, if you're getting you know just uh, if you already have a controller working on dolphin you don't have to watch this part but uh, you can go up to controllers go to emulator Wii remote configure you can go ahead and go to um, it's somewhere in here. Um, yeah, here we go. Point pointer. So you can see I already set these up. So if you don't want to use a Wii remote, you can use a mouse. But as I say, if you're still watching and you already know how to do that, just I want to show people who don't know how to work out <laughs> like a mouse cursor on Dolphin of how it works. Um, I don't know if that made sense, but you know, you know, um, <laughs> that's basically it. So have fun. Uh, you can do this like with all versions, actually. You can do it from 1.0 all the way to 4.3. It's not that hard. Uh, anyone can do it. Um, anyways, uh, thank you for watching. I hope this helped. And I will see you in another video, po possibly. Bye.